In this problem, we'll simplify an expression using the rules for order of operations. We'll simplify the expression 2 to the third power minus 10 times the quantity 4 minus the quantity negative 2 plus 18 times 3. In order to do this, we'll begin by simplifying expressions within parentheses, and we'll begin with the innermost set of grouping symbols, which are the parentheses here, which is negative 2 plus 18. So we have 2 cubed minus 10 times the quantity 4 minus. Now I'm going to simplify the negative 2 plus the 18, and that gives me 16. Now this is times 3. I'm actually going to write in the operation times 3, which might be something you might want to do even on a test so that you don't miss that that is an, an operation of multiplication. Because in our next step, we're still simplifying within the brackets, and we want to do the operations within the brackets using the correct rules for order of operations, which means we want to do all multiplications and divisions before we do any additions and subtractions. So I have 2 to the third power minus 10 times the, the quantity, and I'm going to write 4 minus, and I'm going to perform this multiplication 16 times 3, which is 48. Now, still working in the grouping symbol, symbols, I have 2 to the third power minus 10 times 4 minus 48 is negative 44. Now, everything in the parentheses or grouping symbols is sim simplified as much as possible. So now I move to the next step, which would be do all, uh, evaluate all exponential expressions. And we do have an exponential expression, which is 2 to the third power. 2 to the third power means 2 written as a factor three times. 2 times 2 times 2, which is 8. So that's 8. And we copy the rest of the 10 times negative 44. And now we have a subtraction, and again we have a multiplication, and if it helps, write in the multiplication sign to remember that 10 times negative 44 is the next step we want to do. We want to perform all multiplications and divisions in order from left to right. So I have 8 minus 10 times negative 44, which is negative 440. Now I want to perform the last operation, which is subtraction. I want to subtract a negative number. When I subtract a number, I can add its opposite. So this is 8 plus the opposite of neg negative 440, which is positive 440. And I can finally do the addition and get 8 plus 440 is 448. And that's the simplified form of that expression.